Well, it's Tuesday night and time for the Kitchen Cops. We have seven perfect scores while two restaurants ended up on the B list. Here's Action 10's Annie Lascano with the details. First stop on today's Perfect Score Coronation Tour, Peach Chicken and More on the 4100 block of South... Oh, wait, what's this? We will be closed due to repairs. We'll reopen soon. Sorry for the inconvenience. Darn! Ah, just give them their sticker anyway. Congratulations and well done to the Whataburger and Port A, their first post-Harvey honor. We do have four Perfect Scores here at the Trade Center, starting with Ostres Lily. Then we have Lynn's Sweet Shop number two. Then we have Lulu's Snack Shop. And we have Kekito C. Mas. All four scoring a perfect 100. Congratulations to them. And that's Joey Solis with the first time honors at Garrett's Barbecue on the 4100 block of Ayers near Port. They've only been open about a year and a half, he says. Pretty good, yeah. yeah. A pretty good reputation in town, I know. Well, that, that's good to hear, yeah. Uh, you know, we try to do everything word of mouth. Uh, every, all of our business is pretty much word of mouth. We don't do a whole lot of advertising, anything like that, so. Now here's the A-list. The Whataburger on SPID, Papa John's Pizza on Leopard, both scored 99. Filling Bakery on Cantwell, Bubba's on SPID, both scored 98. The Subway on Highway 77, Freebird's World Burrito on SPID, both scored 97. Taqueria Jalisco number two on Horn, the Angry Marlin on SPID, both scored 96. Brewster Street Ice House on Tanqua, El Gallo de Jalisco on SPID, La Palatera on Castoras, the Subway on Flower Bluff Drive, all scored 95. Wiener Schnitzel on Alameda, Los Altos Mexican Restaurant on Port, both scored 94. Water Street Oyster Bar, City Bakery and Restaurant on 19th, both scored 93. The Exchange on Mesquite, La Palma Mexican Restaurant, both scored 91. Dropping down to the B-list with an 83, Taqueria La Tapatia, number three on Ayers. Violations included food stored on the floor, employees not washing hands between tasks, product not labeled, hand washing sink not accessible, dishes not washed properly, wiping towels not stored properly, utensils not stored properly, the vent hood is dirty, ceiling tiles dirty, missing vent hoods, back door seal needs to be fixed, coolers are dirty, there are broken ceiling tiles that need to be replaced, and the ladies restroom needs a trash can with a lid. The new China Cafe on Port, 80. Inspectors found foods not stored properly, drink nozzles dirty, prep shelf dirty, coolers dirty, products not labeled, no thermometers, no soap at the hand washing sink, roaches, flies, there were personal cups in the kitchen without lids, other violations include wiping towels not stored correctly, paint powder needs to be covered, shrimp and chicken not thawing properly, knives and tongs not stored properly, rice bin not labeled, and there was built-in grease on the vent hoods, ovens, walls, and grills. All right, so got a complaint yourself? Call this number. It's 826-7222. You can leave a message. There is always someone on duty. And as always, to see the list of businesses featured tonight, go to our website, kztv10.com.